Hey guys, happy Wednesday. So today I wanted to do a tutorial, a hair tutorial for you guys. Um, I kind of feel like it's been a while since I've done a hair tutorial. So wanted to show you guys how I curl my hair with a straightening iron. Um, what I find that works great about this look is the fact that it will last for a few days. So depending on your hair type, my hair is thin and fine, so it really only lasts about two days for me. But if you have thicker hair, it's going to last longer, which is perfect. So if you are a working lady or stay-at-home mom or whatever it is, you kind of just have to do your hair or at least spend more time on it the first day that you do it. And then after that, it's just a quick kind of freshen up and you're good to go. So I'll show you guys how to do that as well. So a couple of products that um, you will need. I just kind of use a brush to back home, but you can use a comb. Um, I have the Tresemme Fresh Start Dry Shampoo. This isn't exactly my favorite, but it is cheap and it still works. So, um, And also this hairspray, if you need volume, is absolutely amazing. It's the big sexy hair and it is volumizing hairspray, so this stuff is amazing. So, and you'll also need an elastic band or whatever you have to kind of tie up your hair, and then obviously the straightening iron, so let's get started. So first off, I do like to split my hair into three sections, so um, right now I'm just gonna start with the bottom layer, so I just kind of like to pull my hair back like so. Get this stuff out of the way here. Okay, we'll get going. So, I always like to curl my hair facing the back as well. Um, so, I'll just show you guys what I'm talking about here. So, I like to kind of bring the, pull the straightening iron through my hair just to heat it up initially. And then you just want to put your hair on and turn it back like so. And then you kind of want to keep moving very slowly down towards the ends. And don't quite curl the ends like you can let go now. So see that little straight bit there at the ends? <laughs> and I'm just going to repeat that again. The nice thing about the straightening iron is it just kind of glides down. So I'm just going to grab other bits of hair. And I like to take about a good, well, inch to two inch section. So. Sorry, I'm gonna run the straightening iron through it first and then kind of go slowly. Okay, so when I have the bottom done, I like to hairspray it just a little, not a lot. Just kind of run your fingers through a little bit, like so, and just spray it. And I'm just gonna start on the second layer of my hair. So I like to kind of pull it just about there. I'm just going to tie back this portion and I am just going to do the exact same thing over again. Just remember to curl facing towards the back. Okay, and same thing again. I'm just kind of going to run my fingers through the curls a little bit, just very gently. And just spray again. I also kind of like to put my fingers right at the roots there and just kind of wiggle a bit just to get some body. <laughs> Hopefully you're lucky and don't have to worry about getting body like I do, but if you do, these are just little kind of tricks that I use. So um, Sometimes too, actually we'll, I might try and do this right now. When I have my hair already kind of up, I like to back home a little bit underneath as well. So just lift it up and just kind of go up and down with your brush like so. And I know it looks really funny right now, but we're not going to leave it like that. Just kind of getting it prepped here for volume. And then, again, I'm just going to put some hairspray in. I feel like in grade 8 I used to do this, and it used to stay this way. <laughs> Hopefully it didn't look this bad. <laughs> 
Okay. Anyway, I can't believe I just told you guys that, but I'm sure most of you, or some of you at least, will remember those days where back combing was in, where you didn't really have to brush it out and make it look like you didn't back comb it. <laughs> okay, and just on to the front, and we're again, we're just doing the same. I'm just going to go all the way around here again. So just to reiterate, how you curl with the straightening iron is you want to put it on your hair like so and gently just start turning it all the way down to the end. Just It kind of just slowly just kind of comes right through your hair like that. It's actually like once you get the hang of it, it really is super easy to do and super quick. So. And you definitely don't want to hold the curling iron, or sorry, the curling iron, the straightening iron on your hair for very long. Um, have you guys seen that YouTube video where the girl actually, like, burned her hair off? Oh my god. I mean, this is really mean, but I honestly cried because I was laughing so hard, but... Oh my god, it was so funny. But I felt so bad. The poor girl, like, honestly, how heartbreaking would that be for your hair to just rip off like that? Or burn off like that? Oh. So yeah. Whatever you do, girls, don't hold it on your hair for too long. Like, I don't know. I pretty much, well, you can see how long I actually hold it on for. It's not long at all. And I keep moving it through the hair as well, so. And just do the same thing again. Just kind of tousle it up a little bit like so. And I'm just going to hairspray it. And again, you don't want to put too much hairspray in because then I find it... It looks too done up. Now that all the curling is done, I'm just going to back comb again. Just to give it a little bit of height. Again, I'm just going to kind of tousle through. And I'm just going to kind of brush slightly through the back comb. Okay, so next. <laughs> So I know it looks super poofy right now. So I'm just going to kind of brush through my hair a little bit, just again to give it a bit more of a natural curl. So next, even though I did just wash my hair, I'm going to put in some dry shampoo and this is kind of just to give it volume. And believe it or not, I don't know, it just tends to work better for like tomorrow, day two. So day two, when you go to do your hair, all you have to do is this step. Like you pretty much wake up in the morning, brush your hair out a little bit, and then just lift it up and put on your dry shampoo. And then after that, you just want to tousle it a little bit and hairspray it. And you're literally good to go for day number two and do the same thing day number three. And if you want, day number four <laughs> or five. However long you can make your hair last. Okay guys, and this is it for the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed. And yeah, if you want to make it curlier, just forget about brushing it out. Just maybe brush it slightly out with your fingers. Um, yeah, you can kind of do a whole bunch of looks with this particular method of curling your hair with the straightening iron but anyway guys um here is kind of a closer up look you guys can see okay guys thank you so much for watching if you have any questions or comments please write them below and i will chat with you guys next week have a great week bye